beautiful people it's your girl Faye I'm back but clearly I'm back with another reaction video and uh, in today's episode uh, I'm here with a song by the kings uh, that is uh, living on a thin line and uh, I'm very very excited I can't wait to see what it will unfold uh, and uh, so I'm hoping that you're going to take this journey with me all the way to the end and uh, as per usual I'll be giving my comments as well as interpretation at the end so i'm hoping to see you there and uh, if this is the kind of content you are interested in look no further because you're right in the right place so go ahead right now and smash on that subscribe button down below if uh, you haven't done so already and uh, be part of this beautiful family uh, so without further ado let's dig into the song living on a thin line and uh, hear what uh, the kings have to say about it and you know the drill remember to stick until the end because that uh, why not so let's see All the stories have been told Of kings in days of old But there's no England now All the wars that were won or lost Somehow don't seem to matter very much anymore All the lies we were told All the lives of the people running down Their castles are burned Our eyes see change, but inside we're the same as we ever were. Wow, that's quite interesting. I see change, uh, but uh, inside we are the same as uh, we ever were. That's. Let me take it back, cause uh, that's uh, deep. Our eyes see change, but inside we're the same as we ever were. Yeah. 
quite a good song. Uh, tell me now, tell me now, what are we supposed to do living on a thin line? Uh, so the song was uh, Living on a Thin Line by the Kings. And uh, it was uh, so interesting to listen to it. Like, uh, I really enjoyed it. The beats were so okay. I loved that. And uh, in terms of uh, the vocals, of course, that was amazing. But uh, in, not bad. <laughs> but uh, okay, let me use it. Uh, but in terms of uh, the lyrics, I feel like uh, it's not just so straightforward. It's kind of deep. Uh, it's a deep song, so I'm going to try and interpret it uh, the way I can, and then uh, you'll tell me what you think about it and uh, your interpretation. And uh, please, uh, if you enjoy this, consider to give it some love, give it a thumbs up, and then drop a comment and share what wow do you need, how did it make you feel, and uh, what is your takeaway from it, what is your take on it, anything you want to share regarding this, please uh, be sure to do so in the comment section. Uh, so just allow me to read uh, the first verse of the song because uh, I feel that uh, that is where the song, like uh, the strength of the song or rather the meaning of the song for me comes out from. Uh, so it reads, uh, all the stories have been told uh, of kings and days of old, but there's no England now. There's no England now. Uh, all the wars that were won and lost somehow don't seem to matter very much anymore. Uh, all the lies uh, we were told, yeah, all the lies we were told, all the lies we were told, all the lies of the people running around, uh, their castles having burned, I see change, but inside we are the same as we ever were. Living on a thin line, tell me now, what are we supposed to do? Uh, living on a thin line, living on a thin line, or oh, tell me now, what are we supposed to do? So those are the lines in the song, that is just uh, two verses of it. And uh, I feel that uh, this is where the meaning of the song for me comes out. Uh, so first of all, the first verse that talks about uh, England and uh, like uh, things having changed, but uh, uh, inside we are the same. I feel like uh, it's trying to portray how like uh, maybe our forefathers uh, fought for the nations. Uh, so in this particular case, using uh, England as uh, a sample or rather, I don't know the story behind it, but uh, just explaining it my, in uh, my own way. Uh, so using England as an example, so saying how the forefathers fought for change and uh, now there is change on the outside, but inside we are still the same. Uh, so trying to portray that uh, inside people are, are still evil and uh, like uh, people are uh, more rotten and uh, don't have humanity in them. Uh, but on the outside we see change, everything looks beautiful, but uh, there is no humanity in it. Uh, so saying that uh, living on a thin line, tell me now what are we supposed to do? It's more of uh, this is the current situation. So what am I supposed to do? And there's the line that was talking about uh, what are we going to leave for the next generation? So it's more of uh, like uh, we are damaged and uh, we are still uh, damaging society. So what are we leaving for the next generation to come? So it's trying to portray how society is uh, is the uh, is failing yeah the failures of society so basically that is my interpretation and uh, my takeaway from it will be uh, that uh, like what we see is not what is in the sense that uh, we need to uh, we need to work on our inside so that uh, we don't just uh, portray a picture of uh, happiness a uh, good society but deep inside we are we lack that humanity in us so basically that is my takeaway from it and uh, my I'd love to hear your interpretation, so please uh, drop a comment and share that. And uh, yeah, remember I always say music is an art, and the beauty of it is uh, the fact that uh, you and I can listen to the same song but have completely different interpretations. So please uh, don't share away from dropping a comment, share, and uh, let's have a discussion and uh, get to understand the song from your point of view as well. So basically that brings us to the end of uh, today's episode. It was quite a deep song and I feel it's deeper than that. Uh, so basically that's it for today. So thank you for watching once again. And uh, if today is your first time here, Karibu, 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 Karibu is uh, welcome and uh, feel right at home. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you loved it because uh, the more is coming. And uh, if uh, you'd love to support the channel, you are also welcome to do so. All you need to do is check the description below where you'll find the link to my patron community as well as my PayPal address and uh, 
you can have guaranteed requests through either platforms as well. So once again, Asanteni Sana, Swahili for thank you so much. And uh, I look forward to seeing you in the next one. So until then, take care of yourself and be safe. And uh, for now, your girl is out. So peace out and uh, bye.